Hey, what's up everybody, and welcome back to yet another episode of Minecraft Survival. So, how's everyone doing? We are just over here at the Cactus Farm, and I have pretty much um, done what I wanted to do. I'm like 95% done with it, I'm just not sure what I want to do with the outside now. But, I have made an item elevator here, it works well puts all the cactus up here. Uh, it works perfectly well actually. Um, I'll show you something real quick. Um, I'm not sure if this item elevator has been designed before but it will bring up the the item that just went in so it brings all items up right away. Not like those old torch elevators. Um, but yeah, there's my glass block. And I'm trying to think if I can show it to you without destroying like everything. Yeah, let's go. It's just behind here. So what we have is a comparator going to this from this dropper, uh, making a quick pulse, quick clock, whatever. And then uh, the redstone pulse going up to here where it gets hit by this observer. And this observer goes up into this block, which goes to the first dropper, and then there's redstone dust up there, which activates this dropper, and then also activates this dropper, I believe. Then this senses that, goes into that block, etc, etc. Actually, really simple, and I'm really proud of my design here. Um, not sure if anyone's done it before, but I figured it out myself. So, yeah, um, original design. Now, how do I get out of here? All right, so I have this new crazy idea, which will which we will do later because in this episode I'm not quite sure I want to do that already. But um, in as uh, this. At the second base, I can't speak, It's I woke up like 10 minutes ago. Uh, at the second base where we're digging the big hole, I have a new idea. Instead of building just a base, a regular base like this here, I'm going to build what I'm going to nickname... Well, I haven't made a proper nickname. It's going to be like everything but extra large. So, like, there's going to be an iron farm, like that one back behind me but it's going to be like absolutely massive like 10 times bigger than that at least and it's going to be a wheat farm and it's going to be like the size of this entire green stuff that we see here and a mob farm mob system which will be bigger than that somehow and uh yeah it's just going to be huge and i kind of want to do that just out of interest to see how much i'm going to lag um, I actually got a new processor just the other day. Well, I didn't get it. I installed a new processor. I got the processor a few weeks ago. But yeah, I'm, I'm now running on a Ryzen 5 2600. Um, 12 threads. That's it. It's very nice compared to my other 4 threads. I still have the other CPU and I still don't get the best FPS, but I don't mind. Um, that's only because I'm recording. Um, but yes, everything is pretty good. Uh, Next upgrade, 16 gigs of RAM. Yes, I've been running this a little bit lately. Uh, I was trying to organize all of this, so I got health potions here, and I need to organize everything else better. I've got night vision in there, I'm just gonna put them in there, I think. Because otherwise there's not gonna be enough rooms for potions. So yeah. Oh, okay. Why is that? I thought Splash lo lost... Uh, that's supposed to be like 5 minutes 30, isn't it? Alright, that's pretty interesting. Um, right, so... I was going to do the parkour thing today, but... 
I have a better idea. I was clearing out the area for park for the parkour park thing idea, and uh, I came across a slime chunk. So what I want to do is dig that out instead. Um, do I have TNT on me or anywhere for that matter? Oh, I do. Check that out. Okay, is this a fling bow? No. Okay. We're just gonna go quickly make a slime farm then. Um, this will take a while. I have started digging it out. Uh, it's right over here. So it's pretty close to spawn. So hopefully this will be loaded in most of the time because I'm here most of the time. But yeah, this is the chunk. So that's got like the size of the pads, but we're also going to make it three blocks wide to the sides. Uh, so that, uh, yeah, so that the slimes can fall off and stuff. I was hoping to find a four by four chunk of this, or at least a two next to each other that were kind of close to here, but the only ones that were like closest were like way over there somewhere or like where I've already got stuff built. So this is the closest chunk that works for me, I guess. I mean, the, the, this place isn't going to get used for anything, is it? The parkour, I've, the parkour thing I've allocated to be somewhere, oh my god, I can't get up, somewhere over here. Yeah, I started clearing out space over here, so like this entire pl area is going to be the parkour place. And it should all work out well. Um, Space-wise, I have tons of it. Uh, but yeah, I already started blowing stuff up here, so... We need to go below 40, don't we, before we can start going outwards. So let's just blow up a bit more. It's daytime, good. I don't like working at night. I'll set up the charges and I'll be back actually, that'll probably be faster. Alright, I got this set up, so let's blow some stuff up. Hopefully not die. Ooh. Ooh, no. Ooh, what? Oh! Um, how about we do that? Blast protection isn't exactly my thing lately. <laughs> I've been blown up by a wither so badly. Oh, oh, because this has blast protection, not this anymore. I usually have blast protection on helmet or um, pants. I'll be American here. But yeah, okay, that makes sense now. That makes a lot of sense. And we don't have a beacon here, so this might take a little while. This is my work pick though. Uh, I don't remember if I told you this, if it was before the last episode or something, but I died in the wither fight. So that was not fun. So I'm still regaining my stuff back. Actually, I think I did tell you in the last episode. Oh, I don't know. But I do have a beacon set up at the UFO, so that's all going well. Um, still not sure if I want to do the command block thing. So if you stand where the beacon beam is, you get teleported up into the UFO. Still not sure if I want to do that, simply because, well, like, I have the thing that I'm not cheating in this world, and that command blocks would count as cheating, but it would be a pretty cool thing to do. Well, at least I think it would be pretty cool. So let me know what you think. Um, maybe I'll do it, maybe I won't. Probably won't, but if you want me to, then I'll do it happily. I should be using a non-silk touch pick because I don't have any cobblestone. Well, I think I have some cobblestone, actually. So that's fine. I'll be throwing most of this away now, I think, because I'm actually out of space for it. I thought that the space I made for it, the giant storage room, was enough, but no. There's a lot of stone to go through. I'll need to find a use for this at some point. It's probably... Oh, I, okay, I found a use. 
Actually, no, I didn't because I don't need this. I don't need this exact cobble cobblestone or stone. Uh, I, I need to find a use for it. Okay. Just that's annoying me. All right. I'll dig this out and then I'll be back. Cool. Alright, so, um, this project might take a while. I have less than two hours left to record this, uh, like an hour and a half at most, and I like recording things all in one go. So this might have to carry on into another day, like tomorrow. That is fine, I, I'm just not happy with that, but yeah, I can do all of this grunt work off camera and uh, do something else right now instead and then finish the slime farm later so I don't know whatever you guys want I have collected a lot of uh, I've collected a lot of got it called oh my god I can't break blocks I collected a lot of sand and gravel for concrete so that I can use it at the UFO I was thinking of using um, that at for the uh, floors and ceilings because I think it's gonna look pretty clean but I, I'm gonna need to use like white or light gray colors um, maybe a little bit of black for outlines yeah I'm not, I'm not sure what colors to use uh, you tell me I've never been on an alien spaceship you guys are all alien to me <laughs> I'm joking I am the alien never mind um Okay, so, yeah, I have collected a lot of that off camera, probably not enough for all the floors, but there is a lot, <laughs> and yeah, this project might take a little while, as I said, so let me just finish cleaning this up and I'll see if I can do something else for a few minutes, maybe, before I continue this. This will be done by the end of this episode, I promise. I'm not sure if I've shown you this yet, but over here in the farm, I have fi completely finished this now. So, got this all done. It's 100% it's finished, this farm, and uh, I'm very happy with that, actually. That's a wrong statement. The ground, not ground, basement level of this farm is completely finished. This still wants a fence gate here. But yes, this is completely done now. This is 16 blocks long. I have made the redstone signal work, so it all goes all the way. Uh, I'll show you right now and how it works. It's pretty simple. Uh, there's just a repeater going to this block and then a wire here, which goes into both these and this block, which powers both of these. So it all works. Yeah, it's very nice. You get loads of stuff from it and it's basically awesome oh yeah I just stepped on this and I made it so I can walk into here so that if any melons drop onto these I can still pick it up same with that side just like so it all works very nice. And in case you haven't noticed, I'm still in 1.12, because um, I hate 1.13. Never gonna upgrade it to this. I'm gonna upgrade this world to that. Never. Gonna always play in 1.12. 1.13 sucks. And on top of that, it lags. So there's really no point in me, like, playing in it, is there? So yeah, we're gonna stay in 1.12, and yeah, 
that's good for me because I like 1.12 hmm hoppers are quite expensive aren't they alright so we want to make a chest here for boats so that uh, when we get to the other end of this tunnel we can bring the boat back without having to like drive it back well I don't know slide it back uh, so I was thinking of putting hoppers all along here but now I'm thinking if like a nice stream would just be faster because hoppers are expensive I'm gonna need these later and an ice stream will pretty much do the job won't it so thinking of where I can put it now because this is quite a long tunnel and uh, what I'm worried about happening is that the boat boat item will despawn when I leave the east chunks I'm not sure that's gonna happen actually it shouldn't happen but it will it will stop it will completely stop in its tracks at some point if I leave the chunk while it's not in the water I'm pretty sure because that's what minecarts do but obviously I'm not, I'm not in the minecart so um, oh no not these guys not today so yeah um, let me think of something real quick Alright, so I dug a little bit of a tunnel here all the way that way. Got quite a few resources from doing that. And yeah, uh, this just needs to be made out of ice now. And there's mobs here, apparently. I'll get some ice then and I'll be back once the world loads in and I'm done this took a little while and uh, let's see if it works <laughs> we do all this and then I find out there's like a mistake somewhere there the whole thing's broken need to dig it all back up alright let's see we're gonna drop a sign in, I think. Then we're gonna try. We're gonna wait a few moments. And then I'm gonna go with the boat. So if all the chunks were loaded right now, I'd say that the sign gets there about now. So let's see. Uh, of course, I'd intercept it if it didn't get there, so it would carry on get going there, of course. We'll see, though. Should be here. It is not. Ooh. Oh, now it... <laughs> Alright. Alright. So, apparently, boat travel is faster than item travel on ice. I was thinking quite the opposite. <laughs> Alright, um, well that was, I'd say that test was a success, but we need to do more tests. So what we're going to do is we're going to get some boats, we're going to travel back and forth using the, using the end. So I'm going to drop this boat off into the ice stream. when I get here and I'm gonna use the next boat to travel to the end again where's the end portal? It's here, okay alright we spawn back in and then let's go back to the road and we'll try that all again
Whoops, that was not a good idea. All right, so let's go down. It's not there yet. So let's carry on going as if we were using this again. Uh, thinking of sending this boat back as well, because that's how it would be. So it would be just like that. And then we'll basically do this again and again, I think. Is the first boat back yet? No. Okay, we'll carry on doing this then. Until it's back. Okay, so we do that, and let's go back. Sorry if this is boring you, um, I'll probably cut. Okay, is the first one back yet? The first two are back, okay. So the third one will probably be back right, like right now. Or be on its way somewhere there. There it is. Alright, so this all works. That's nice. I um, guess we'll put a hopper here. For now. Um, and then I'll make it go up into this, this chest. There's another point. Uh, I don't have time right now. Uh, I'll go work on the slime farm now. Um, and I'll be back tomorrow because I don't have any more time to record today, unfortunately. So yeah. Hmm, I've been waiting a while and I'm not getting any slimes here. Ooh. And this is at Y35. So yeah, not sure what's happening. Maybe the slime finder app was wrong. Pretty sure the world generation hasn't changed since 1.8. Or like, actually it probably has. But I used the world seed. Like, I imported the actual world. Hmm. I'll have to wait a bit more to see if it actually works. I wonder if MC Edit um, has the feature to see if it's a slime chunk. Because maybe I should have just done that to start with. I'll I'll go check in MC Edit. Give me a foot. If I can hit you. <laughs> there you go. Wow, that knocked back. Okay, no foot. Waste of my time. Okay, so I tried using MC Edit and uh, it doesn't see if it's a slime chunk or not. I did use MC Edit 2, which is a, which is in beta, so maybe not all functions are in there yet. But I didn't see if it was a slime chunk or not. It didn't say, it didn't specify anything. So I'm just going to assume that it is, and I'll come back to it later when I know that it actually is. And for now, let let us go finish uh, doing that boat return system. So we need some hoppers. I'll just take all of them. I I really like this uh, observer thing I did with the droppers for the what's it, what should we call it? Um, the oh, come on for the cactus farm. Yeah, it's still early in the morning. Okay, this is. To, this is tomorrow. Okay, so we're just gonna have have it go up to there, I guess. Oh, this might cause some trouble. Cause it's gonna be permanently on, isn't it? Let's just do it something like this then. So we don't get any trouble. Okay, that's good. And 
that many blocks down. Okay, and I'll sh I'll show you how I set this up. So it just goes into a dropper here. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> I have no idea how to do this with such little space now. So it goes into the dropper. Then out of here, we're gonna let's out let's do it out of here. Yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Let's do it out of here. So we're gonna have our observers allow observer facing up this way, and we don't need any more. Apparently, we just needed one. Nice. I like that. It's not a waste of space. Parator set that to uh, subtract mode. Repeater. I'm getting Discord message. Just do that, and then. Ooh, okay. That could have caused some unintentional problems. Okay, just do this. There we. Oh, okay. I didn't know. I didn't know that. And so then you just stack these all up, like so. Put your chest back, and let's see if it works. It doesn't work. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think maybe that. Oh, oh, wow. Okay. Okay then. We'll just do it like that then. Yeah, no problems now. Where did it get stuck? Or did it all go up now? It's all up now. Okay, so let's just see that again. Um, working properly this time. Yep. All good. So we can cover this up now. That is done. I am happy with myself. Let us not have to... I'm done too early. Oh, never mind, never mind. That lights it up. I wanted it to be lit up so that uh, no lag is caused. I'll do it like this though, so that the ice stream can't melt. Just in case. Alright, and then let's do give this a uh, qu quick little test drive, see if how well it works. But n there now should always be a boat there, so that's good. And I'm pretty happy with myself. Um, I'm going to leave the slime thing until next episode, I think. Oh, wait, we're not done. We need to come up with something here. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Um, all right, let's think. Gonna need some purple. Like so. Whole bunch here. Okay, something was there. And one there. That's already purple. Yeah, okay, I think that's it. And then we're gonna want some something so that we can't fall off in there. So let's put a trapdoor there, I think. I think. If we have a trapdoor like this then we can Yeah, we can open it, drop the boat, close it, that's good. 
No, I want my tool back. Like so, and that's good. Let's go through the portal and do this all over again. They're not back quite yet, should be back any minute now. Any minute. Any second. Do I need to go back again? It does take a little while to go this far, but bam. That is quite a long way. Seriously, I don't want to wait this long. Any second. All right. Well, we're just gonna start start finishing the episode then. Um, so yeah, today we started digging. Well, continued digging out the massive chunk there. Um, 100% finished this now. The only thing that is left to really do is on the other end to like have a proper room there and stuff. I don't know, might do that, might not, might just leave it as it is. I don't mind, but this is this tunnel is now 100% done, has an automatic boat turn feature, which is very good. And yeah, it's only took like a really 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 long time to do I'm I'm hesitating to say it took a year I don't know how long exactly though probably close to a year though I think the boats might be stuck somewhere but yeah this does work um, we can run this way to see if the boats might have gone stuck there to just load in the chunks or something Chunk should be loaded in now, let's go back. Yeah, uh, got quite a lot planned to do in this world still, not gonna finish it anytime soon. Never gonna switch to 1.13 because that's stupid. Why would anyone want to play in it? It's the dumbest update ever. But yeah, thank you for watching and as always, I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good day, bye bye.